Good morning, Modern Studies. In the last video, when we worked on the composting outhouse, we got it strapped. This morning, my goal is to get it figured out what we're going to need for boards, get some angles cut, get some boards cut, and later this afternoon, when I get home, we'll come back and we'll start putting some boards on. Just over seven feet. Under so six and a half feet. By fifty five. On the back side we're gonna need the same. Awesome. Now that we got our first one cut. I can figure out our next one. It needs to be 12 and a half to the long point. Let's cut our 19 degree bevel. Then we put it back to zero and 12 and a half to the long point. So that means the one after is going to be 9 and 7 eighths to the long point. I'll flip it around being a longer board. Nine and seven eighths to the long point. Same thing, flip it over. Boom. Let's get our first two boards installed. need to be 9 and 7 sixteenths wide. We're going to have to go rip that last one just a little bit. board right here and cover that up. All right, I think we're going to be able to get this side sided before we go to work in the, for the morning. We'll be able to come back this afternoon and finish it up. I like that. We're going to start pushing the board over, straightening it out to the doorway. further. Let's see if we can get these to work for us. Yeah, that closes the gap up. Put one more on this if we have it and see if it'll get it a little bit tighter. Oops. It would help if I got on the board.
turned out nice. Get a length on the next one. Perfect. So we get one more board cut. That tightens that gap up nicely. Nice tight gap. nails last two holes two nails put in get the new roll of nails put in the video is not over yet it just means in the next scene, it'll be the afternoon, just like this. I'll be able to go to the lumber yard and get the right width board I needed for right here. I'm just gonna flush it up with the inside of my window. Tack it in place. I'm going to have this trimmed off later on so this little gap we can either fill with the board and leave it. Because our trim work will hide it. I don't need to cut quite a few at 45 and 3 quarters. Alright, let's see how far we can get with these six boards. boards above the window put in.
Let's get this last board in under the window. Try this now. There, I like that. Fits much nicer. I told myself I wasn't gonna go over this far, but oh, I can't stop. It's a sickness sometimes. Hard stopping when you know you're so close. We're short on time. We got some other projects. We got some other things we gotta be doing tonight. I should be picking up right now, but let's see how many boards I can get cut and get put up. I know we can at least get these four up, and then we'll go from there. See what we got for boards. Oh, I think these boards should work perfectly. Let's get them up and in place. Just right. I wedge it in with the hammer. It'll close up the little gap we have. I like it when your plan works out. Nice. Let's get this finished nailed. Awesome. That corner came out nice. We just gotta finish up these boards next time. I know, it's so hard for me to stop too. I just wanna get it done. But I gotta stop here for today. We gotta go pick up Figaro tonight. Gina and Olivia are excited to go get Figaro and so am I. It'll be interesting picking her up and introducing him, I should say, to Pluto. Ready, want some pig action? Hey pigs. You guys are dirty and muddy, and you look happy. Are you a happy pig? Dirty, happy pigs eating apples. Hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Share it, it's really helping the channel grow. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed. And we'll see you right back here tomorrow at Lumna Acres, a guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom. Bye.